welcome, welcome, welcome to Lauren's House Reading Corner. I'm Monique, and today we will be reading Scooby-Doo, Dinosaur Dig. And this is by, hmm, doesn't say who, who wrote the book? Oh, Aaron Schoderberg. Aaron. Scooby and his friends were helping Velma's Uncle Ted. Uncle Ted's job is to find bones for the museum. He gave the gang a shovel and a rake. Lit like this, we will work hard, Shaggy said. We need food and cookies before we start, or burgers and cookies before we start. Have you found any bones yet, asked Velma? Look in that box, Uncle Ted said. Scooby looked. The box was empty. Oh no, Uncle Ted shouted. All the bones are gone. Let me try to get this in a better angle so that you can look at this. Maybe there's a dinosaur ghost hiding all the bones. Shaggy said, no, said Scooby. We have to help Uncle Ted find the missing bones, Velma said. He needs the bones for the museum, Daphne said. Let's look for clues, gang, said Fred. Shaggy and Scooby looked for clues. They found a food truck. Let's check the truck. Shaggy said. They found some apples and cookies, but they didn't find the missing bones. Jinkies, Velma said. She found a big rock in the ground, but there were no bones. Fred and Vel and Daphne found a bucket, but they didn't find the bones. I wonder where the bones are. Well, gang, Uncle Ted said, let's make a fire. We can look for the bones in the morning. Uncle Ted made burgers. Then the gang roasted marshmallows over a fire. Look, or like I hope, the, the dinosaur ghost does not like marshmallows, Shaggy said. Did you hear that noise? <coughs> Shaggy asked. Scooby, let's go check it out, Velma said. Scooby jumped into the sleeping bag. Would you do it for a Scooby snack? Daphne asked. Oh no, all the Scooby snacks were gone. Did the dinosaur ghost take the Scooby snacks? Scooby wanted to find the Scooby snacks. Come on gang, Fred said. Maybe they will find the bones. Hopefully they would not find the dinosaur ghost. The moon helped Scooby and the gang to see in the dark. Scooby used his nose to search for the Scooby snacks and the bones. They looked in a sleeping bag. They found Uncle Ted's dog, but they did not find the missing bones or the Scooby snacks. Scooby smelled Scooby snacks and waggled his tail. Scooby digged a giant hole in the dirt with his paws. Uncle Ted's dog jumped into the the uh, the hole and pulled out some bones. There was no ghost. Who do you think the ghost was? You found the bones, Scooby, Fred said. You saved the museum's dinosaur, Uncle Ted said. You are a hero. Velma threw Scooby a Scooby snack. Scooby dooby doo! Scooby barked. Thank you for tuning in. We'll see you next week.